Hey, Brian here from quantlabs.net. <clears throat> Just wanted to give people an update of where I'm at with things. Uh, a few days ago, um, we've been, um, or I put out a, an alert about uh, that we're seriously looking for uh, a trading system, high frequency trading based. Um, and we got some good responses from people like uh, companies like Nova Sparks. Ninja Trader, uh, some open source solutions like at, over at uh, Hortonworks. Uh, thanks to everybody that's responded. Uh, this is what the plan is. Um, building a custom trading platform is a very complex and complicated setup. Um, you know, being really a very small operation, it's myself, a few column volunteers that, that, that see the vision. I'm actually working uh, in consulting uh, with a real world quant as well out of London, UK, um, and some other real people that you know uh, by, by name. Um, so essentially uh, building a trading platform is a huge pro is a huge job. I mean, I've been spending uh, probably about two years looking at different technologies and different ways of doing it. Um, and uh, it, unless you are a fairly large operation, to roll your own solution uh, is quite a bit of work. Um, so, due to the fact of the challenges that I've been facing for the last, let's say, a couple of months, um, this topic has come up with this quant out of um, London. And uh, he suggested I take a look at multi charts. Now, I've heard of multi charts, but I thought honestly it was just a charting platform or just a glorified charting system. I thought, eh, okay, not, not a big deal. Um, but when I started learning more about multi charts, not just multi charts, that it's multi charts.net, it's a special edition that, that uses the power of multi charts, which is a full on trading platform, multi threaded, um, as well as with a .NET capability, so you can build indicators, signals, strategies, all done in .NET, either in VB or C Sharp. So obviously I'll do the C Sharp. So that was kind of appealing to me. I played with it, put up some YouTube videos on it. It looks really cool. Then I thought, why, you know, I'm still on the Simulink, MATLAB Simulink kick. Is there a way I can generate MATLAB C++ code and drop it into into uh, into the ecosystem or the API of multi multi uh, charts, and it looks like it can be done. I just gotta uh, I'm still piecing it together. I'm still going through the weeds of the API, understanding the API, understanding the the language. I guess the power language. At the same time, there's references to uh, to uh, Easy Language, which is the uh, the language for Trade Station now. TradeStation is a very powerful platform. It's probably one of the biggest ones out there. The issue I have with these type of platforms, uh, be it TradeStation and something like MetaTrader, when I fooled around with MetaTrader a few years ago, I was really impressed with its capabilities. The problem I had with it was two things. Uh, it was proprietary trading language and you're tied to a questionable broker, something that you don't know and are they manipulating your trades, so on and so forth. So when I saw multi-charts, it was like, whoa, this is addressing both of those concerns. First, I have choice. I can choose who my data provider is. In my case, I like my IQ feeds, so we got to check there. Then the trading, uh, uh, the, the um, trading broker I want to go with is Interactive Brokers. Really the only broker I have in Canada uh, is really interactive brokers, so that was a check there. So both are reputable. I, I am currently with IT Feeds, very happy with them. Some new developments are coming, which are going to make them even better. Um, and interactive brokers are consistently improving things. So because MultiChart supports that, as well as I can now develop everything in .NET and C Sharp, that's even an extra bonus. So here's the other advantages you get with it. I don't have to worry about data capture. I don't have to worry about trade execution. I don't have to worry about charting. On and on it goes. If I have my own solution, I have to worry about all this stuff. It's a lot of work. On top of that, you have to go through all the debugging and da 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 da. So, 
All that's been thrown out now. All because I'm using multi-charts, as well as I have the capability to, to work with the multi-charts API, as well as generate my own models coming from a tool like MATLAB. So now I'm working on a bridge to bridge those two worlds together. Once that happens, which I think it can happen, it, it, it's, a, it's just a very, very, very exciting development. And it's very powerful. Um, so what's happening now is, is that my mind is starting to think, like as if I don't think. <laughs> Anyways, um, with my membership, it's critical now that I can now focus on strategies and trading and model development, strategy development. At the same time, I can develop some really cool strategies are already to just bang out reports. There's one capability I'm kind of impressed with within the world of multi-charts, or I should say easy language trade station. You can record videos. So if you hit a certain condition, you can have your strategy or whatever automatically kick in and record video. That's really powerful because then I can automatically record a movie and then upload it to my membership to let people see how my strategy is working and how it evolves. And that can be all automated. So it's very, 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 very powerful. Um, so I'm very excited to see these kind of developments. And these are things I would never have thought of. Because of that, that really changes how, uh, what can be delivered in this membership. Here's what is going to happen within the membership. Simulink models are going to be provided. The C++ that's going to be generated from that C++. That tool right there with the Simulink coders were $15,000 in and around there with the licensing with MATLAB. So that's right there. From there, there's going to be a DLL be created within Visual Studio. From there, you can then create your strategies, your indicators, and your, your signals all within C Sharp to call that DLL which again is from, from MATLAB or MATLAB Simulink. So, and then you can take that DLL, that C-sharp DLL, and, and have Matt, Matt Multicharts call it. I'm, I'm sorry, but I'm, 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 I'm quite amazed by that because it's not with a proprietary language, it might add. It's C-sharp, .NET, probably what's Java, .NET, or the, pro, the top two out there in terms of programming uh, popularity. So again, very powerful, bringing in a lot of new um, content, we'll call it, as well as, you know, regular webinars, regular interact interaction between my membership. I'm about 120, give or take, um, that are active. So it's growing. Um, so hopefully uh, things will get uh much better over the next few weeks as I start to understand what I can deliver uh, through through multi charts. Now here's the thing with multi charts. Um, I get a lot of non programmers. This is another nice advantage with it. If you know how to implement a strategy or an indicator or a signal from that's for multi charts, you're ready, pretty well ready to go to start trading, and not just start trading, but to do it in an automated way that is created by somebody like, you know, myself or somebody who's volunteering to help us out. As well as maybe down the line, we'll have a community of people doing the same thing. But we don't want to have this out in the public domain. The reason being is that trading is all about edge. And the fewer people that are involved, the better. I mean, obviously you want a bigger membership, but you want to kind of make it exclusive so that it makes people uh, have give them an edge over the masses as if they went to uh, some website and downloaded a bunch of indicators or whatever. But that, that's what I'm thinking. As well as quite possibly having a some kind of alert service um, uh, on, on, on things happening in the markets in real time. So these are, these are things that I'm thinking about right now to really, to really add to the value of, of the membership. So I just want to bring people up to speed. I'm hoping to have something that I can demo with, with, uh, multi charts coming from the world of MATLAB and uh, Simulink. Uh, and once I show that, I'm, I'm going to be very excited by it because this is the farthest I've come. Um, you know, building a model 
and then having it in a real world trading environment with charting and all that stuff. So it'll, it'll be kind of cool to see it. And then from there, be able to develop actual real world models that we can implement, start trade, you know, paper trading against real, real world data from IKEA feed in real time. So that's the plan and I'm hoping you can be part of it.